Locally, Monroe County is still under a flood warning this morning, or at least parts of the county are. Carmela Boykin live in Ellison Park in Penfield with a look at the impact there. Carmela, good morning. Good morning, Mark. There was a ton of flooding last night, some of which has receded, but some of which remains. If you take a look, like you said, we're outside Ellison Park, which houses Arondequoit Creek, a common flood spot. Over an inch and a half of rain fell here yesterday, and this creek surged, one of many across the region. The park has water overflowing into the roads, and as cars drive by, they are having to avoid this overflow, and it will likely take some time to to recede because of how much fell. Again, there still is some flooding, which will take some time to recede. In Rochester, Carmela Boykin, News 8. Mark? Carmela, thank you for the live update. We see that standing water there. Significant flooding also reported in some areas east of Rochester last night. The Red Cross telling us it will send resources to parts of Ontario and Yates counties, setting up temporary shelters. This is video from Crane Street in Clifton Springs late last night. Many roads there closed because of the flooding. Businesses and homes dealing with rising water levels as well and flooded basements. And check out this footage sent to us by Rob Cizale from Sulphur Creek in Clifton Springs right near Main Street. Uh, those who live in the area say this creek is usually just about a couple of inches deep. A far different story late last night with that rushing water. James Gilbert coming in with us now. Yeah. Uh, James, the rain, as we've talked about all morning, has moved out, yeah. but uh, the impact is still being felt. Yeah, certainly. Uh, we uh, definitely will see more uh, of those creeks and streams fill up, uh, I think, over the next couple hours, and then they level off, they kind of plateau, and then finally drop down. It can take several hours uh, sometimes after the rain has ended for those rain showers to end. All right, or for the uh, fl flooding to uh, slow down, rather.